Dr. Barco here at Lexington Podiatry. Today we have a patient who has a recurrent ganglion cyst on her foot. Her pain isn't super bad with it, but this is just going to show you that these things can come back. We say that all the time, but patients don't always believe us. Um, she knows because she's had this done before, so she's no stranger. So basically, we're gonna focus in on the foot here, and I'm gonna show you all that. We numbed her up previously, so you can see that little bloody spot where we numbed her up. We painted her with betadine to protect her against bacteria. And now I'm gonna say, can you feel this? No. Perfect. So we're gonna just pop that cyst. I just like to go slow so I'm not hurting the patient. And sometimes they get a little pressure. That should be it for the pressure though. And then now you're gonna see all this ganglion material that's gonna come out. And it's usually clear, it's kind of jelly-like. And you can see this can really cause some patients a lot of pain. I think our patient here today is just very tough. Sometimes when Dr. Carter does these, hers fly across the room. I try not to do that. <laughs> But look how much relief a patient can get from doing a drainage. And we're just gonna keep melting it nice and easy until we get everything out of there. And then we're gonna put a little compression bandage on it for her. And I have had a patient have one of these come back in five hours. This is what the patient said. She did come in the next day and I saw it. So she was right, it was at least a day later. Then I've had some patients tell me it lasts them five years. Everybody's a little different. This patient in particular that we're working on today says hers lasted about one year. Just wanna make sure we get all of that out of there. Sorry, my voice is crazy, guys. I had uh, some allergies. So this is how we drain a ganglion cyst and it's with minimal pain and the patients do really well afterwards.